Hello, I'm Mike from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, I will show you how to add color filters and color grading to your videos in Adobe Premiere Rush CC. So here we are in the app, playing back some nice footage of the uh, ferry there from the Isle of Wight, but I might want to uh, color filter this a bit. So up here, we've got an icon here called color. If I click that, well, we've got all kinds of built-in presets. Uh, maybe we want the SL night to give a, a kind of nighttime kind of feel of leaving the Isle of Wight does a really good job of it actually. Uh, you can go for SL Gold, SL Matrix, uh, you can even go to Monochrome. Just at the click of a button you can really start changing the look and feel of your video. Uh, but if you want to go into more detail you can go into Edit here and you can edit everything from the exposure making it brighter or darker like so to the contrast adding a bit more contrast, uh, pulling out the highlights or reducing them say if we've got too many highlights reflecting off the sea there shadows again, increasing or decreasing the blacks that are showing up. Color temperature and tint are really going to change the feel. So going up here, we're going more yellow or more blue. So we might want a really blue filter seeing as it's, it's quite a blue scene. And again, with the tint, uh, we can go up to magenta or down to green like this. Maybe stick somewhere in the middle. Vibrance, just like Photoshop, it'll make the colors pop out a little more. Maybe that's the look you're going for. And saturation again, uh, pulling those colors, making them kind of almost dreamlike and unreal. Uh, but it might, again, be the kind of color filter you're looking for. Then we've got advanced options such as faded film. So bringing this up gives that kind of like film style effect. Uh, you can also use the sharpening to really sharpen what you've shot there. Look at the sharpness there in the waves uh, on that part of the, uh, the solent there. Or I can blur it out a little bit if I'm looking for a blurry view. And that might help with a vignette because I can move up a vignette like this or uh, turn it, if I turn it up this way, it's a white surrounding vignette or over here it's black. So maybe white's good. And then the amount of feathering is how feathered or how circular we want that vignette to be. So if I make it like this, it's kind of almost like it's a dream that we're flying through. Or I can make it black. So we've got that kind of dreamy vision happening there. Say I end up with a template that I'm really, really happy with. Well, up here, the three dots menu here, I can create a preset saying, Mike's dream. And then every time I want to go to another clip here in Adobe Premiere Rush, like for instance, say this one over here, I can go straight to my presets. There's my preset, Mike's dream, boom, it's applied. That is color filtering and color grading made easy in Adobe Premiere Rush CC. I hope you enjoy doing this and let me know how you get on in the comments to this video. <laughs>